Hello, in today's video we're going to start off by making dinner and we're going to be needing fettuccine, fresh basil, a stick of butter, parmesan cheese, heavy whipping cream, minced garlic, you could use champagne or not, that's optional, and chicken and we're going to use three quarters of an onion. And I'm going to start boiling some water for the pasta. And now let's start marinating the chicken. I'm going to be using a teaspoon of olive oil, a teaspoon of chicken seasoning, and a teaspoon of seasoning salt. And now we're just going to be heating the pan we're going to be cooking the pudding. While the pan is warming up, we're just going to be dicing the onion. Now that the pan is warmed up, I only added olive oil and we're just going to be putting the chicken to cook. We're going to be cooking it 4 minutes on each side. While the chicken's finishing cooking, I'm just going to be grating the cheese. And now that our chicken is fully cooked, I'm just going to be setting it aside. I'm just going to leave it on the plate for now. And I'm just going to be using 2 tablespoons of butter and I'm also going to be drizzling olive oil. And then we're just going to start cooking the onions. And we're going to be cooking the onions until they're translucent. And now that the water is boiling for the pasta, we're just going to be adding a little bit of salt and a little bit of oil. And we're just going to add the pasta to it. 
give it a quick stir. Make sure your, your pasta is not sticking together and just let it cook for 12 minutes. The onion does take a little bit long to cook, so just keep stirring it. Now that the onion is fully cooked how I wanted it to be, I'm just going to be adding a teaspoon of minced garlic. And this is optional. I'm just adding a little bit of wine just to kind of release the flavors that are stuck in this pan and just give it a little bit more flavor. Make me high then low Tell me let's take it slow Next thing that I know And now I'm just gonna be reducing the heat and also we're gonna be taking a cup out of the pasta and just set that aside. We're gonna be kneading that later. And all I think is and I'm just going to be draining the water from the pasta and I'm just going to give it a quick rinse with cold water and then I'm just going to drain that as well. Okay, let's finish making our sauce. So I'm just going to be adding the whole carton of heavy whipping cream and just keep stirring that. No matter what you think now, I'm so happy that I found out. You were nothing but a fake home And I can say it out loud When my mommy said you're sorry And I'm just gonna be seasoning the sauce And you could just add whatever seasoning you want And I'm just adding about a teaspoon of each seasoning And I'm just adding half a cup of the water we set aside from the pasta. A minute ride made me lose my way One minute high knew my life would change And I was hoping that you could stay The city lights will let me know. And make sure you guys taste your sauce just in case you guys gotta add anything. Just keep tasting it and make sure it tastes good to you. Please reduce the heat from your stove before adding the cheese. And now I'm just gonna be adding the parmesan we created earlier. And just keep stirring it and add little by little. Counting every hour, every second makes it easier to
changing, everything's changing When I'm with you, I see all that goes Feels like I'm fainting, much like a painting No colors of blue And I'm just gonna be adding our basil Keep your pan on low heat and we're just going to be cutting the chicken. No, I'll wait for you. Nothing can break us two. Babe, I wait for you. To the moon and back, we had a love like that. Why do I feel like that's slowly fading? We used to be friends, that was way back when. Now let's add the chicken to the sauce and then we're going to be adding the fettuccine to it. I topped it off with fresh basil and now here's a close up of how it looks. Now that we're all done with dinner, we're just going to start cleaning up the kitchen and we're just going to start it off with loading the dishwasher.
I'll be using common just to clean the sink with. And now we're just going to be cleaning the counters with Mrs. Myers and the apple cider scent. I'm just going to be cleaning the stove with the Power Paste Sponge Scrub Daddy. And I'm just gonna be finishing it off with the uh, Mrs. Meyer spray. Now it makes sense to keep on breathing, keep on living. Wherever you are, there's no fear. Talk of the town. 
And now we're just going to be using SEP stainless cleaner to clean the dishwasher and the refrigerator. And I'm just going to be wiping down the table before we start mopping.
just gonna be giving the living room a quick vacuum. And this wraps up today's video. I really want to thank you guys for sticking around and watching it. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you again on the next one. Bye.